that I am no longer natural and that, yeah, I'm not, I'm not gonna be claiming that anymore. So, Natty card revoked. I wasn't gonna make this video. My next video was gonna be a vlog, but something big came up in the fitness industry. 17 hours ago now, Dylan McKenna put up a video titled, Am I Competing Naturally? Dylan McKenna and his mates have been heavily under the spotlight for those headhunting the fake naturals. Essentially in his video, you should go check it out yourself, he goes over what he is currently doing in terms of his own personal goals. I strongly advise you to go look at the video yourself because it fleshes out most of what I'm saying here. But if you want the long and short, essentially he talks about the current bodybuilding competition he is prepping for. He is competing at a local NPC competition with the aim of one day becoming an IFBB Pro in the men's physique division. With the aim of one day becoming an IFBB Pro in the men's physique, he essentially disclaims that these federations are very rarely drug tests, which naturally means a lot of these athletes are using and abusing different compounds. He disclaims that he has personally been taking some form of performance enhancing drug with the aim of pushing his physique to its limits, although he doesn't specifically specify what it is that he is taking. Personally, I have a lot of respect for the fact that he is coming clean. Did I say, did I say? I meant, I think most people honestly suspected he was using something and it hasn't come as a big shock to most that he is in fact admitting to using stuff. I mean, here's a photo of him looking at least on par with known drug abuser, Brandon Harding. As for what this means for his brand, I don't think it'll do any harm. I imagine he would have had a conversation with Gymshark and other sponsors, just disclaiming that this is what he wanted to do, and I'm sure if they said no, he would have left it out. So for the most part, I'd be very surprised if they didn't mutually agree that he would be able to come out and talk about it. The more interesting question it raises is more to do with his friends. So Gymshark and other of his it is very unlikely that in his circle, he's the standalone person taking drugs. When one is, generally the majority of them are. So who knows, time will tell. I'm very interested to see, you know, the kind of outcomes of this, how other people respond. But yeah, that's the long and short. Like I said, make sure to check out Dylan's video. I don't want to take anything away from what he said. I just thought I'd give you guys an update as to what's going on. But in the meantime, you know there's some shit we have to do. Thank you.